adding glitter to our freshies let's talk about it so the question i received was is it okay to add glitter to the oil that you're using to make your freshies with you can right there's a couple of ways to do it but really the real question is what type of glitter are you using that's the real question we're gonna get into that real quick so first of all if you wanted to do it that way let's say you have like a mason jar you add your oil in there then you add your glitter in there then you add your aroma beads in there then you shake it up and you let it cure it's gonna be dispersed throughout the beads however unless you're using like a whole thing of glitter I don't think you're gonna really get the glitter effect that you're looking for and the only reason I say that is because I tried it it didn't work for me right I got some glitter but it's mostly in the middle and as you know people only see the outside right you could you know go ahead and do your aroma beads and your oil let it cure and then add the glitter to that mix it's going to give you the same effect right because the glitter does not absorb into the bead it's just going to be on the outside so either way of doing that it's the same um the most popular way of adding glitter to aroma beads to freshies is to you know add it to your mold and then add your aroma bees and then bake it or if you're doing the cardstock method you put your cardstock down add the glitter around the edge that's going to be exposed and then add your aroma bees and then bake it and then you can really have control over how much glitter is showing up as far as being aesthetically pleasing right now let's talk about the quality of glitter so there's different types of glitter i'm gonna tell you right now i've tried a lot of them we're gonna talk about it i should do this in another video but i'm gonna do it right now okay so the synthetic glitter is gonna melt right so when you see those ones that look like sprinkles or whatever it's gonna melt they're not made to withstand heat and it's gonna turn brown and it's not gonna be aesthetically pleasing it's not gonna look good nobody wants that okay uh, there's glass glitter glass is glass it's gonna cut you it's gonna cut your customer right it's gonna be sharp so I don't recommend it but go at your own risk um you want to use like aluminum based glitter right it can withstand heat it's going to keep it shine it's going to give what it's supposed to give right those these are my recommendations do what you want to do i'm just telling you as someone who's been making freshies for the past couple of years this is what i recommend period peace